What's good, you guys? It's your boy, SJK Dot, the first Black Super Saiyan to have arrived on this planet. I'm back here with another video. <sighs> the sad news. Look, I know my subscribers was like, yo, K Dot, bro, you gonna get Mortal Kombat 11, bro? <laughs> you know, I mean, I might. But, you know, I ain't feeling it. Because, um,. This game is taken away from what I like about Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat is an M-rated game. So you're going to get M-rated stuff. Busty, sexy women. You know, you got that. You can see a bunch of skin, right? And, you know, you, uh, granted, you got some male characters that got they, that don't got clothes on. Goro, he's a male. And, and he walks around in a little uh, tart thingy. A little, his little Tarzan thingy. But you don't see women complaining about, oh, put some clothes on Goro. But when it comes to the women, they want to be all butt hurt. But when it comes to the man, they okay with the men having their shirts off. And I'm like, what the freak? So the men could have their shirts off showing their nipples, but the women got to be fully clothed? Come on now. I mean, Mortal Kombat was keeping it fair before. Showing the women show a bunch of skin, the men show a bunch of skin. It was fair. Equality, right? Equality. Now, you got some cases where you get... Mm, Middle Eastern girl. No skin, no nothing. You know, she, she fully clothed. This is Scarlet from MK9. And I'm over playing this game. And I'm watching this chick. And she got this red suit on. But my girl Scarlet, let's go back to MK9. She was looking good up in MK9. So you're telling me. I get this right here and this is fire bro look at that mm. you give me this and this is an m-rated fighting game where people guts get pulled out shoot you can have these people nude for all i care and then you get to this what the freak is going on bro man let's go back let's take a step back to my girl oh my god Let's look up Sonya Blade. Oh my goodness, bro. Look at that. And mind you, Sonya Blade was already working with the military, working around, walking around like this. She didn't care because she, you know, bro. You couldn't tell Sonya Blade what to do. She'll wreck you, bro. You couldn't. She will wreck you. She got skills. And she looked good while she's doing it. Now, granted, you know, let's not forget, also in these games, yes, some women, some women will be offended by this. But hold up, when you got a man with no shirt on, all the women just come flowing in like, oh my God, she looks so sexy, man. Keep his shirt off. But you don't see us men complaining. No, but the, all the women want to complain, right? Okay, let's go back to Mortal Kombat 11 and see my girl Sonya Blade looking all ugly in the face. Her face is small. Her breasts got some, ugh. I'm good, bruh. She looked too, uh-uh. What happened from MK9 to this? I'm good, bro. I'm good. <laughs> oh, and uh, also this right here. You guys, I want to show y'all something. I never thought they would do this. And you know what? It makes sense because there have been a whole lot of SJWs feeding. How does an M-rated game get attacked by SJWs? How do SJWs? It's an M-rated game for a reason. They're going to do whatever they want. In an M-rated game. And then some SJW's going to pull up. You ain't need you to incorporate and be, and you know, be hip for us. We need you to bend to our will. Now I'm over like, what the freak? You're Mortal Kombat. I'm playing a game about you taking guts. And now you got me over here worrying about some. Bro, they got some pro-black propaganda up in here, my G. What the freak? And with a character that wasn't even pro-black in the first place. It was just a black dude. With metal arms, doing a who on um, black guy. Yeah, pro black. Who? Huh. Huh. And I'm like, what the freak? He pro black? What? Huh. what? This is a fighting game. I don't care about this. Huh. It's about Outworld. It's about Outworld and this whole world war and struggle. And I'm like, what the freak is going on? I need my women to, you know, have to be a little busty and sexy. The only girl that looks sexy up in this game is Cassie Cage, let's be honest. All the in Katana. Mmm, Katana looking good. At least Katana. 
somewhat retain what she's supposed to look like, though. Dang, look at that. Oh, my God. That face, bro. She got that. Mm, she get, This game's so detailed. She got that beautiful Asian woman face. Look at her, bro. Dang, look at that back. Man, let me see. Oh, my God. She look good. Dang, that suit looks sexy, bro. Dang. And then you go back to and then you go back to uh woman from the Middle East. Dang. Great. Dang. The fuck. You go back to her. Dang. <laughs> no sex appeal. But she looked like this before. No sex appeal, no nothing. I mean, you got these these uh, these these uh, these women that aren't even sexy that I'm looking at, bro. Come on now. My man Luke Kane got his shirt off and stuff, and women over is like, oh my gosh, you're showing too much skin. She still got clothes on. Sure, she's showing a lot of skin, but she still got some clothes on. Look at that. Her breast is covered. She wearing her little thing here, but at least she wearing some clothes, right? Look, look at these arm fingers here. That's clothing. It counts. She's not fully, she's not naked. She's wearing clothes. Some people don't think those are clothes. In my opinion, those are very much clothes. Do you guys know Tarzan? is not fully naked his little tarp thingy clothes now let me show you guys something now i'm like man i gotta take a step back from this i'm sorry guys i can't get this like i'm not vibing with this stuff look what they did to jacks bro shout out to amazing lucas let's check this out just watch guys watch 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 hi 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 all i wanted was to fix my life now I have the power to fix history. Raiden warns me, I can't fix everything. Change too much and I could lose Vera. Lose Jackie. But this power is bigger than us. If I think only about helping myself, what kind of officer am I? What kind of man? I've been lucky. My family and I have lived the American dream. Uh-oh. But most people look like me haven't had that chance. I owe it to them to put things. You for real, Jax? For real, my nigga, Jax? You serious, Jax? Come on, Jax. You got to find a way to shoehorn in black oppression in the Mortal Kombat. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And you know what? It's with our black character that they do so. whoop de freaking do Huh. You found a way to get it up in there. Thank you. Thank you. You found a way. Of course. It's the black person, too. Let's keep going. That's right. And I'm not waiting centuries for people to get woke. When I... Shouts out to Amazing Lucas, bro. He caught this. I'm not waiting centuries for people to get woke. Get that corny line up out of here, bro. I'm not waiting centuries for people to get woke. Freak out of here, bro. Shut up, Jax. Your weak metal arms, bruh. I've got the power to speed things up. I don't get it right the first time, or the second, or even the third, but eventually, I knock it out of the damn park. My family's back. The world's a better place for everyone. Turns out. Everyone? I just see black people here. What about the white people? What about the Asian people? What about everybody else? How are they doing? It looks like all the black people are happy. And let me and let me guess. Let me guess. <laughs> let me guess. He's in the mother home. He's in the motherland of Africa. You guys, I'm gonna tell you guys this much. As much as I love my fellow black people, I would never want to go back to Africa. Reason being, I was never born there. For one, um. It won't be easy for me to integrate at all just because my skin is black. You got to think. Africans and African Americans, you got to think how they're going to get along. It ain't going to be peachy fuzzy, bruh. Yes, America has some messed up stuff. But at the end of the day, I grew up here. I'm, fam I'm familiar with everything here. The only reason I would move somewhere else is if I did my research on it before. If I prepped myself to understand the laws. Uh, I, I got my uh, passport and everything. I got everything I need. I have my home set up. I try to learn the culture the best I can. And I'm like, oh, I'm going to take my move and go. I'm not, if something would happen, I'm like, oh, I just want to up and leave and go to Africa. 
Okay? I mean, I grew up in... I'm an African-American. African-Americans and Africans are two different things. Yes, we look the same, but our cultures are totally different. African-American is something that, you know, at blacks developed on our own in America. We developed our own new culture here. We got a little bit of remnants of our culture in Africa, but then it all branches off into something new. It's totally different, bro. It is totally different. It will not be an easy integration. So, you know, good for you, Jax, but, like, what about the white people? What about the Asian people? What about the Middle Eastern people? How are they doing, bro? Because all I see here is uh, black people chilling. What you do What you do to all the white people, Jax? Hmm? Where the white people at? Where they at? Because I wonder, what did he do? Who, who did he kill? You can have everything. Anyone who says you can't needs to dream bigger. Okay, Jax, this is what you could have done to I dream got the bigger. Power to speak Let's go back. But most my family and I have lived the American dream. Bear with your homie on But most people look like me haven't had that chance. I owe it to them to put things right. Okay. Okay. Jax is a little bit selfish here. You know, this is a little thing in the black community. Now, Jax. Why don't you do this? Because remember, yes, black people were enslaved for more than four hundred well, more than four hundred years. We was enslaved for a long time. And what happened to us was messed up. And there's some things that the black community is still owed. For sure. There's still some things we are owed. Especially some funds that our ancestors are deserved that should be coming to us. You know, reparations. Hey, but you know, that that's that's we don't want to get into much of that. But what I'm going to say is, Jax, yeah. slavery happened in ancient Rome, Han Dynasty. Was there? No, I'm thinking Han. Yeah, Han Dynasty. There was slavery in Asia, the Middle East. So why don't you do this? Why don't you go back even farther, even farther? Why go back to just that time and just fix it for African Americans? Fix it for everybody. Because what I see here in this, Jax is just like, hmm, only for black people. That's what I see. He said a, a better world and a better place for everybody. Nigga, you, you show me one part of the world and you over talking about it's a better place for everybody. And you show me one part of the world. Bro, that was a futuristic Africa. That was Africa that we was looking at. All he did was show me Africa. What this was, yo, black power. This is their way of integrating black power, bro. This is the first time I've seen this in a Mortal Kombat game ever. Like, it was never something I was actively searching for. You know, something that's like, what do you, like, are, are you trying to check off some stuff? It's like, why you got this up in here? Are you trying to check off some stuff? Bruh, they got these women looking busted up in here. I'm good on this game. Sure, Scorpion and Sub-Zero look solid, bro. They do. But you got my girl Scarlet looking busted out here. What they do to her? Ugh, she look, man, they got her fully clothed now. And it's all bu these busted looks. Man, you can miss me, bro. I miss you with this. What is this? What is this? I I am a 19-year-old. I mean, I am a 19-year-old man, you guys. I'm a 19-year-old man. I got, ugh, I'm a, you guys. I'm a 19-year-old man. I play these games for a reason. They're called rated M for mature for a reason. You don't see me playing Grand Theft Auto. And... The first thing I'm trying to look for in Grand Theft Auto is some nude women, bro. That's, it's just plain facts. Sure, you, you can't find in older GTAs, you know, probably mods and stuff, but in GTA 5, bro, you can casually walk into somebody's house, go by their pool, you see a nude woman with her, bro, this game, I see a lot of pandering going on to make women happy, right? This is Mortal Kombat, a rated M game. You don't do this for rated M games. You don't pander, bro. You don't. You don't. It's rated M game. You can curse if you want. You can have this, this, and that. It's a rated M game. It's a rated M game. Now, if this was a rated, uh, if this was a, um, uh, not PG. A G-rated game, even if it's a rated T for teens, I'll give you that. But if it's a rated M, 
Don't pander to people. Do you. Do what you really want. I know they didn't want to do this. I know they didn't want to make the women like this and make them all fully clothed and stuff. Bro, Cassie Cage is looking sexy up in uh, Mortal Kombat uh, 11. No, 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 10. She had that black leather suit on. She was looking good, bro. I was like, man, do I need to show y'all a picture? Bro, Cassie Cage looks better in Mortal Kombat 10 than she does. But Cassie Cage is looking good up in Mortal Kombat 11. They fixed that ugly face that she had, bro. She was ugly in the face. Look, she was looking good up in Mortal Kombat 11. Look at that fully black. All that black, yo. Look at that. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And now she looks like this in Mortal Kombat 11. She looked good. But earlier, they had her looking like this. What's this? What's this doo-doo stuck face? That witch's nose. Them, uh, them teeth. Them lips. Bruh, I don't want that. That hair, ugh, bruh. This is Cassie Cage, bruh. This is Cassie Cage. <clears throat> Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Fire, bro. She's fully clothed and she still looks sexy, though. That's the thing about it. You can see her curves and everything. Dang, man, these people, bruh. Look, he's showing all this muscle. Why, 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 ain't, why don't he got clothes on, huh? But he's a man, right? It's okay for women to look at men and see us nude. But when it comes to women, we gotta be all like, no, you can't see them nude in the video games because we gotta respect women. Oh, but for us men, it's okay for us to take off our shirts and y'all get to see our characters in our games, you know, half naked, doing what they gotta do. Man, come on now. Y'all weak, bruh. Y'all weak, bruh. This Mortal Kombat, yo. We, we like to look at these women like, yo. But, you know, you guys, I just want to say that about Mortal Kombat. I might get it. I don't know. But, you know, when I like to play Mortal Kombat, I like to play as the female characters. They're lucky Melina isn't up in this game because they would have ruined Melina, bro. They would have made her, they would have fully clothed her. Man, they probably would have fixed her teeth, too. I'm good, bro. This game's all about pandering, bro. The only thing that's still rem remnant of Mortal Kombat up in here is the fatalities. And you got Scorpion, Sub-Zero, Cyrax. Uh, Sector. I saw that fight, bro. It was going. It was fire, bro. But look, I can't, I can't hop on this pandering garbage wave, bro. This is video games. This is a rated M game, and we're pandering to people. We're pandering to people. Jax is out here talking about, oh, I'm on my pro black stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh, yeah, huh. We're calling the forever. And then I'm over here like, bro. You just showed me you, you're making the world a better place, but all I see is your your fictional world of Africa. Where's the world? He's talking about make the world a better place. You made the world a better place. I just see Africa. You made Africa in black people into a better place. That's it. That's what that was. What about everybody else? You're going to leave everybody in the dust? Okay, Jax. All right, guys. Look, I ain't going to be in here long. I'm going I'm to upload this, but you guys, go start that peace, love, positivity, and all that jazz. Yeah, do not do drugs. Please don't do drugs. If you guys do drugs, that's on you. That ain't on me, but I, I warned you. Don't do drugs. I love all you guys. Avengers Endgame is coming. I'm going to do a video on that. Avengers Endgame is coming this week. Yeah. Be ready to go see it. Some of y'all get to see it on Thursday. You're lucky. I get to see it on Friday. I get to see it after you. So, you know, whatever. I don't care. Yeah. Thursday is a is a bad luck day anyway, so uh freak you bruh. You you got Thursday sucks anyways. Oh, it's all about them Fridays. It's all about them Fridays. All you who get to see Avengers Endgame on Thursday, just know Thursday is the worst day of the week. So ha 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 jokes on you. Friday is the best day to watch Avengers Endgame. Facts. Sucks for you that you get to watch it on a Thursday. The worst day of the week. Mondays are better than Thursdays. Ha, jokes on you. But you guys, peace, love, positivity all the time. Doses. Be ready. Avengers Endgame. Doses.